What's up, boys? Me a bunch. It's gamer time. Because, um... I don't know. Life. Yeah, the dog might not be in him, bro. Jake used to be really small, too. I think Jake was, uh... Well, Jake used to be... Really big, and then he got really small. He used to be a chubby boy. And then he got, uh, pretty skinny and small. And then he got big. Right. Something around his heart? Uh, so that's the thing is like... If I wasn't playing it, I... If I wasn't playing SPL and I wasn't streaming, I could, I could easily just only grind the gym. But um, I kind of struggle between like switching between grinding the stream and grinding the gym. What the fuck? No, I don't. That's why I said earlier. I don't eat if I'm not uh, lifting at all, pretty much. I don't get an appetite if I'm not lifting. Okay, I'll explain. I'll explain why streaming is weird with the gym, for me at least. I hate doing schedules i hate doing like a block you know what i mean like i'm going to bed at this time i'm i'm waking up this time i hate it bro i i hate living in it i hate living that way because i feel like i'm trapped i'm like trapped in a box and i like i can't do what i want to do i literally hate it so much that's why i don't have a, i've never had a stream schedule in my life i literally cannot stand it it ruins it sucks all the fun out of it it's just trash. So, before, if I wake up and I scrim, then I would stream for not that long, and then I'd have to go to the gym. So, I would, like, it's just difficult to, to balance both of them um, if, you, if you have my brain. I want to go really hard in one or the other. I want to stream a fuck ton of hours. Uh... Or I want to focus on my macros and get big. You know what I mean? It's hard for me to balance things in general. I usually just go hard on one thing. But... Uh, I'm gonna try to change it up. An enemy has been slain. That is so true. That's the beta no gains mindset. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Your middle tower is under attack. It's working on making money? Nope. Yeah, I mean, that's that's the thing, right? Mine now. Nothing 
We don't gotta we don't gotta flex or check people's uh lifting yards. Ability is meaningless. Work out. Usually when I'm going I'm doing a three and then one day off. Triceps are like the entire definite, or like if you have big triceps, then it looks like you have big arms. Biceps don't really matter. Yo, what are you talking about, bro? What is, what are you talking about? Are you talking about shooting somebody with a fuck? Like, what the fuck are you talking about, bro? Fucking no, man. legs yeah usually i do chest try back by legs shoulders He's getting silly. He wants to use his ultimate ability here. It's getting extra silly for not instantly canceling it. Good boy. 
He, him stepping up like that, he's gonna get, uh, he's just gonna get his old force. And then what he should do is just knock me up and start walking away, but instead he's using the whole thing, so he's just, uh, just, uh, pretty silly in a lot of ways there. Shooting with me here. But he is. Enemy spotted. Oh, the leader stacked. Uh oh. You can fully off this too now. Slides, bro. Okay. Control the arm. down does it ready aim you're mine now It's actually pretty slow stacking in this game. The thing is, Axe tier 1 is very good still. Just the summary Axe is kinda. My 
Sen de rakta yakışır ben. Alright, so they have a uh, six in one Osiris. That's cool. I love that. Enemy has been slain. That's a bit of a jungle situation. An ally has been slain. is going to be way too strong. Yeah, we should just be like nowhere around that guy. Yeah, try to farm out. So far behind. That's your
probably gonna get that if you don't buy the I'm getting cringed on from every position and I'm just dead. I'm getting flanked by a Yamoja and a Naja. I either get walled or I get Naja ulted. Unironically, getting 1v9 by an Osiris, and we continue to show up to his side of the map. For 20 minutes straight, they kept going to where the Osiris is. You're so when they could have just farmed this Mulan and had a side of the map to play off of. These are just different, bro. Uh, playing solo in these queues is just so ass, man. It's so ass. Like, these guys got shit on so hard and right that I couldn't even rotate and help them. And I believe in this move on, it doesn't matter because they just have a fed jungler. And now I watch my noobs just get farmed the entire game. Just so silly playing solo and shitter queues. I still don't know why Stu is off roll. See the grind set? Man, I don't think I'm ever hitting these queues again in the morning. These players are dog shit. We're coming over, this should be good. I've been one shot by this assassin. Oh. On four for me. Shut down. My flame cannot be extinguished. Bro, Bill Ken's I'm tipping to you. Let's give the crowd. Oh, he missed his thing. I'm still dead. <laughs> Oh, yes, so much, man. One jungle in the queue. Oh. And they literally dies every single game, can do it. I don't know how these people are real, man. Die to every gang, show up to the side of the map where the Osiris is showing up to instead of going mid or solo. Yeah. Just turbo into the game. Bro! Bro, I'm, I'm being a complaining Carl, yeah. but like... I can't believe how bad these Qs are. They're literally, they're literally unplayable. I mean, no one's gonna stop last from queuing as a role. Uh, this matchmaking is just crazy. I don't know, we have Stu off roll, and then we have like. Yes, I'm toxic versus last, bro. And I've never seen this guy before. It's just silly. Last is 1v9. Bro, I think Boys? every time I picked Surtur, I was game time.